Hello. You know, when you're fixing your food, everything has got to be just so perfect. Hello, and welcome to Chef Stefan's Kitchen. Today we're making tortellini and tomato sauce. So just warm it up and it's finished. Uh, no, it's not that easy. We need the bouillon cube. And we will spice this up while we just put this in the microwave and warm it up. And now let me see where my knife has been going. There is knife. And now we have to make hole. And then put in microwave. And this part will be done. Microwave, three minutes. Two to three minutes with 600 watt. So now let's go on to this part here. Cut the wings out and slice the packaging open. Or you just be a man and you rip it open. Yeah, you can rip it. See, just ripped open. <laughs> Now we are starting to cook. I'm breaking half the bouillon cube, just putting half of it in, saving the rest for another recipe. I'm crumbling it in so it dissolves easier. And then of course we are adding our pasteurized tomatoes. Oh, all vampires are getting hungry now! Especially the vampires in Hungary! <laughs> you can also use the tomato mark, but this stuff is fine. Tomato is tomato. You could use ketchup if you are disgusting. Yeah. Because then every Italian out there will puke. And we do use muggy tomato cream soup. Not just a bit of it. Just to, to spice it up. Interestingly enough, this stuff isn't really red. It's more whitish red because of all the cream let we have added this we're folding this over and then the ends in here like this and then we're putting my girlfriend's nipple clamp on here see Fold it over, now it stays fresh as the morning spring. And now we're adding some water. Otherwise it will be too strong for us. You can always add more water. So now let's put it on the stove. You mean we actually say it? That's right. Welcome home. May I help you? I got one. Make yourself at home. The call fun fresh. It's never too far. So come as you are. Welcome home. The chicken is home. Ooh, looks like something a witch would brew. <laughs> I've forgotten to put some tiny amount of pepper in it. And a little idea of salt. By the way, the foaming up is just because I've used carbonized water, I don't buy the other stuff. The other stuff comes from the top, but the top is way apart, way away from here and I'm not running there. Capisce? The thrill of off-road racing is coming home! It's Racing Hopper's Electric Racing. You get the jump on the competition. Your Racing Hopper blasts full bore up Monster Mountain. You dive fearlessly over the top and cut him off as you blast for the boulders. Then you squeeze him out and leave him up a creek. You don't dare back off even when you want to most. Because winning off-road takes skill and guts, especially when it's Racing Hopper's. Racing Hopper's Electric Racing, new from Tyco, of course. Now let's switch on the oven and start cooking. And so... 
Let's put it on the stove in the tiny bit of fondor. Just that's enough. You can use Majoran oregano or something, but I can't find, so I don't use. You could try tea leaves, but that's probably disgusting. And we don't want to disgust the audience, no? No. You don't have to be country to know great country taste. Introducing McDonald's new country-style McChicken Sandwich. You don't have to play country to enjoy all-white breast meat in a crisp country coating. You don't have to fiddle, pluck, or squeeze to see how great those special country seasonings taste. New country-style McChicken, only now you take just your silver spoon and stir it around. Uh, but don't use a silver spoon if you have vampires invited. And use blood instead of tomato sauce if you have vampires invited. Then they love it. Oh yeah. It's getting very very smooth. And spicy. And put your spoon on the handle of the pen. This way it doesn't get hot and you burn your fingers. So now let's put the candeloni in the microwave. You could make them in the water, but why bother? Three minutes and let's go! Now's the time to get out! Hit the great American road Get up, get over, get smart Your Buick dealer is the place to start Now's the time, now's the time Hit the road, hit the road The great American road Cause the great American road belongs to Buick And so, there we go, finished! Plenty of sauce, which is practically delicious tomato soup, fresh candeloni, and I'm serving it together with water, but you can use red wine if you drink alcohol. Or if you're American, you can drink it with a Coke. <laughs> oh yeah, this is delicious. The sauce is just perfect. Mm. That is delicious. Now let's try one of the candeloni with the sauce. Very good. <laughs> Look how this looks delicious. Mm -hmm. The sauce is very strong, very fresh and tomatoey. Mm -hmm. This is very good. And to show you the inside of one of those little candeloni, they are filled with flesh. That's meat. Yeah. Oh, delicious. A bit more sauce. Mmm, yeah, that's how you make sauce. And yeah, it's easy to make. It's plenty enough, well, it's enough for one fat person or two normal persons or a real hungry person 
and a not so hungry person. Two not so hungry persons. Mm. All for ten top models. <laughs> yeah. It's probably not enough for a sumo ringer, but... It's Italian anyways. And sumo is not Italian. I assume it's Japanese. Oh, Japanese. You know, Japanese. Oh. <laughs> mm. Easy to make with a delicious result. So, <laughs> I'll eat one more here. Well, so. <laughs> Hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time here at Chef Stefan's Kitchen where we take something ordinary and add the tiny little sprinkle of extra to make it extraordinary. Delicious. <laughs>